we have gone from a loaf of bread to juicy croissant. What is what wrong? With what you? is wrong? Are you eating? What happened? She is so quite shapely. <laughs> Hello there beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing well. Today I'm excited because we are about to boost that booties, honey. Patricia has got you. I want us to try on the good, the bad, and the ugly when it comes to the perfect pair of jeans because I know it can be hard out there, okay? Some of us are shaped like a tooth, straight up and down. Some of us are scared that our muffin top is making someone out there really hungry. And some of us have thighs that look like tree trunks or ankles that look like twigs, but we just want to be cute. So in reality, it's so hard to work out what pair is actually the right pair for you. I feel like I have gone through so many pairs where I've looked like a pancake or I've looked like a hot mess. And I feel like I'm getting to work out what works for me. So I wanna share that info with you, but I decided to enlist the dream team of booties and bodies. Today I have the dream team here with me because I wanted to do a video styling jeans but I didn't want to just focus on myself because we've all got different body types. Some of us are tooth shaped or as Maureen said, oblong. Some of us are hourglass and curvy but we all need jeans, right? We all need jeans. Damn right. And I feel like everyone here has got their own insight when it comes to amazing jeans and you've got some who are a little shyer. Lydia, but she's got a very nice waist and I wanted to make sure y'all see the waist, okay? And we got Celine with the thighs. Thunder thighs save lives. Thunder thighs save lives, okay? And then we've got Maureen who's, we're gonna call her a slim thick. Is it slim thick? We can, we can roll with that. We'll go this. with slim thick. She said oblong, but she got a little booty coming. And so I decided I'm gonna bring everyone on. We're gonna try the good, the bad, the ugly when it comes to jeans. To give you guys the insight you need, we'll have links down below. <laughs> give me more, yeah. Lord! That's it! That's it! That's it! I'm joking. And snap. <laughs> okay, so our first lovely model is Lydia. Hey, girl! Uh, Lydia is our hourglass figure. And do you know what? I'm being extra so that you guys can actually get some insight. We go measure, and I'll tell you that I'm around girls who love their bodies, their shapes, they're confident, and they don't mind sharing their numbers. What's the thing that you find the hardest when it comes to finding jeans? Um, to just make you look like if they don't pull you into the waist, you just you turn into an uh, actual trunk, like a <laughs> tree trunk. Square. I know Lydia loves basically high waist. Mm -hmm. These are your favorite pair of jeans. Why are these your favorite pair of jeans? Because they're like the only ones that are actually come up to the waist. Because when they say waist high, they mean like here, here, which is it's not a hip. So what are these jeans? <laughs> these are Levi's mile high waist. Yeah. Also, Lydia is tall. How tall are you, Lydia? Five ten. She's five ten. Tall, thick, fast waist. Okay, and let's see the back. You always tell me about your favorite kind of pockets. Yeah, you gotta have like a reasonable size pocket, but not too, because if you have it too big, it makes your ass look flat. But if you have it small, it looks like you sat on a postage stamp and it's just. just Does it make you look extra mess. wide load? Yeah. It okay. Looks like you're trying to post your ass. Okay. So for hourglass, supposedly the most complimentary shapes are a boot cut, straight leg, and dark wash. I've never seen you in a straight leg. Would you wear a straight leg? If I can find one that fits. If you are also on the thicker side, look for stretch so you're comfortable. Okay, Lydia's out here in a boot cut. A boot cut and I actually feel like they actually look good. Who, do you like boot, boot cut? I do now. They're, she does. Really nice. <laughs> they look so nice on, I could never. I would look like a pensioner in a boot cut. Like, am I a cowboy? But you look good. I like these. You know, you look all put together. Looks snatched, you know? It looks nice. I like, I like the cut. But it looks good. Mm. Like these. First one. Hello. Okay, hold on. What else have we got here? What are these? Okay, so there's a boot cut and then there's a flare. Mm. Oh. 
Yeah, looking struggle with the K. Looking fashion. Hmm. Try it on. Try it on. They're not even going out to the crotch right back. Now, Lydia, do you want to hobble over here? Because these are her perfect waist size. But listen, <laughs> listen, the thighs. This is the reality. Hashtag reality. Like, like this is her waist size, but can't get over the hips. Can't get can't, over the thigh. And also, there's no stretch in this denim. No. There's no stretch in it. That's what it needs. Or now you bought your size, but you're trying to put them on and they're grabbing your crotch. We don't like this, okay? We need stretch. Lydia. They're fashionable, they're fashion. Let me show y'all. Yeah, no. Be more than a 32. I don't think even a 32 would have gone over your thigh. Like, because there's not enough stretch yeah. in these. But it looks like it's been ravaged by dogs, so it's fine. And it's low rise. It would have been a struggle. Don't worry, girl. You didn't miss out on anything. These are a straight leg. Do you know what? I feel like they might be nice, you know? This is interesting. Let's try it on anyway. These are a straight leg jean with a high waist. Now, I feel like the waist area looks really nice on you. What do you think about the straight leg? I mean, it's too tight here, and then it's baggy and also too short. Yeah, it's doing it's, ankle swing. The... Look at the swing. It's swinging at the ankle. No. And it's like baggy tight waist. at the back of the waist, but then bagging out the front of the waist. Yeah, it's definitely, <laughs> they're all pale on the ass. It's just making it look like a loaf of bread. Like. <laughs> a loaf of bread. Okay, can we go and put on the perfect pair of jeans, please, love? We have gone from a loaf of bread to juicy croissant in these jeans. These, wow, wow. Okay, Lydia, hello. So, what are these and why are these your like go to pair of jeans? These are Levi's Mile High, and so they make the, the waist actually meet your waist. Yeah. And they can get them in small waist, and then you choose how long the leg is by the inch. So, they are, they are actually going under my boot. And they're also contoured, like, you've got to contour your legs now. You've got to have dark hair and then light hair, and then they. So you feel yeah. like when you've got the light panel there, it kind of gives you a contour and a bit of a shape. It's yeah. like makeup for your trousers. Yes. <laughs> I like that. Okay, turn around, let's have a look at the back. Pockets are the like perfect size pockets that you say. They're not the postage stamp pocket. No. <laughs> They're the, the right size. Stretch, yeah. high waist, skinny. But the boot cut look actually stunning. So they don't just have to be skinny. Okay, thank you, Lydia. <laughs> Okay, so stop the press, right? So um, Lydia's just come back. She loves these. These are from Miss Guided, right? This is where the pocket detail comes into play. Please turn around. <laughs> it looks like, honey, I shrunk the pocket. Why is the pocket at your neck? Why is it so high? We need to zoom in. Like, why is the pocket doing this? And you see, pocket choice matters. Pocket choice matters. Our next person is here. We got Celine in the house. Come up and say hi. Celine is my social queen, okay? <laughs> Had a little moment. And Celine has got more thicker thighs and is a little bit more straight in the body. Great. I feel like we've got quite a similar um, body shape, you know? Mm -hmm. I have never touched Celine's <laughs> leg before and it is Fun. Mm -mm. But anyway, so these are a little bit more straight. So what do you like with your thick thighs that save lives? Um, so I like a stretchy denim. I don't like denim that's too thick because it's a struggle to get up. So struggle to get up, <laughs> yeah. like an old lady. Like, like. It, <laughs> they just get stuck here and it's, not, it's just not gonna come all the way up. So these are um, the Jonies from Topshop and they're like super, super stretchy. I love it because it's just like, I can, you know, I <laughs> got my legs and all of that. So yeah, that's my kind of favorite. And I love a skinny jean because um, I'm quite, I wouldn't say I'm short, I say I'm average. Uh, well, people might say I'm short, I think I'm average. You've got athletic thighs. I do have an athletic build apparently. Yeah, look at the shape of the thighs. See how it's going like that. Um, the only thing about these Jonies that I hate is that the crotch, yeah. Does it not rub? And yeah. then the next thing you've got that gash right I'm in the middle of your thigh. I have to change these. I, like, I have to change my jeans like every eight months because 
like I have another pair that I've had since like last Christmas and already like you can just see the fire is just peeking out at the side so that's the only problem with the thinner denim they don't last very long but we're gonna try some other jeans for those of us with the thick thighs so for thick thighs the thing that you're meant to go for is darker denim stretch boyfriend jeans but make sure they're not cropped because they're gonna make you look extra wide but to be honest I don't even care about the advice let's see what actually looks good on I have a feeling that these are gonna look so cool on Celine. Oh, hello. I need these for myself. What, what leg are these? 32, okay, try these on Celine, hello. Okay, so here's Celine in the straight leg and I feel like they look banging on her. I feel like it suits your style. Do you feel like it suits yeah, your style? Definitely. Like super cool with the trainers. I could never wear that, my feet are too long. So they're a bit more straight in style, but yes, they look nice on you. I like the colour and the wash of them as well, actually. Really nice. Yeah. Really nice. Hello. Um, but I had to give Celine my belt because got to take the belt off. Like these were a thirty. Yeah. And what was my waist again? A thirty. Her waist was a thirty. So the straight leg suits her really nice. But what she really needs is something that kind of comes in a bit smaller at the waist. Mm -hmm. But you said that your thighs. Yeah. So like I can feel it in the thighs. Yeah. It's like this just is like touching. a perfect fit for my thighs. If I get a size smaller than this. We're gonna have that strong, and because it's not like stretchy like that other material, yeah. it's gonna be a problem here. And then my thighs will feel like really tight in them. And yeah, I don't know. It's giving us there isn't a booty. It's giving us the booty disappeared. <laughs> However, it's not every day have the crack on show. It's kind of just doing no relax. There might be something hiding in there you don't know, but there might be nothing. You might have a secret, and I quite like jeans that keep you a secret. But yeah, it's it's not. It's not doing much, but it's not making them look worse. Okay. I feel like Celine might have a body that looks good in all jeans. Cause she put these on and they're just giving me, oh wow, I like these. I like these. These are a stretchy high waist, slim fit, but not like super skinny jean. And they look great on you. Yeah, like we're getting some booty puppage. Hello, a little bit right there. How does it feel on? It was a bit um of a shimmy to get on, mm. but it doesn't feel tight, like and uncomfortably tight. Like, I can feel them much more than the other ones. I had more room. Yeah. But yeah, it doesn't feel uncomfortable. So, and I like it because it feels like it's like, like it's holding yeah, the fire. Yeah, it's holding it in. The fire <laughs> um, is in there, like living its best yeah, life. Yeah. And then the leg here, like it isn't that tight here, but then I think that looks good on you. Yeah, I quite like it. Again, because I said I have like quite big calves, so it's not like suffocating the calves. They're breathing, they're mm. ventilated, it's nice. Oh, and Celine is just serving us cool girl rawness. Like, I wish I looked this cool in jeans. <laughs> I feel like I don't, but you look great, babe. You Thank look you. great. I love it. <laughs> I'm actually annoyed right now because we are meant to show like the good, the bad, the ugly when it comes to different jeans. But it appears that Celine looks good in every jean. <laughs> um, she's also got the flare on. Look how good the flare looks on her. Meanwhile, the booty has gathered, snatched <laughs> upwards. It's uplifted into the sky. It looks great. The flare looks good on. The flare doesn't look like a trumpet. It looks wonderful. So if you've got this body shape, you can look amazing in everything. I think these suit you the most. You know what? I would have probably never put myself in these. Mm -hmm. But where it's because again, I don't want to bring like more attention to my thighs, especially because it's going like that. They afterwards. looking good, girl. But I just don't know. <laughs> she is still quite shapely. <laughs> really? Okay, listen. <laughs> Dance move coming out. Okay, if you've got thick thighs, try a little flare situation over here. You might be surprised. I actually think she looks good in these. No. We need to put her in this room. The the crop flare. Because Ooh. you can't do this. Go and get another <laughs> jeans, go. 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 Hooray! Jeans that don't look amazing <laughs> on Celine. They don't look awful. We're not feeling the flare. The low waist doesn't Low waist looks good on you still though. But yeah, it's giving you long crotch, like you're yeah. hiding a penis. Yeah. So what you don't want to do is have long crotch. And it's 
with right. this body type. Oh yeah, and the back is doing depressive booty. Right. Diaper, bottom, right. Diaper booty. So this style of jean is quite. It's got no stretch in it as well. No. That is why the stretch is magic. We need a last day. It feels like some dogs just came and like, attacked me. Like, was... Ravaged by dogs yeah. in fashion. And I can, do you know what I can see? It's just the way the crotch is hanging. Yeah. And I know this is a really unattractive like visual. And it's not like all the... It's just... Mm. There's like a gap here. This bit isn't right. We need to like say, say no to long crotch. But thank you, Celine. You're welcome. You look fantastic. Shall we do on our next individual? Okay, and here comes Maureen, my sister. Now, I don't know what to call Maureen Shay. I think she's like slim girl gone thickish. She's been working out on the gym, in the gym, on the gym, in the gym. But you know, she's been working on the booty. Look at the, we got a, look at, look at this. A little sighting coming, but you don't really have hips. Excuse me. Oh, do, oh, no, I'm, oh. jo I'm joking, I don't. <laughs> I don't. She doesn't really have like lots of hips, but you've been building the thigh. This is all work. This is all the work, but she's still quite slim. And so she's a bit more slim. So what do you like when it comes to your jeans? I do quite like a rip in my jeans. Oh, um, why? It makes it so it's not just straight so you don't all the like way up and down. Exactly. Less chew best. Exactly. So where I don't necessarily have that much shape per se, I quite like details and rips is a thing that you know, kind of works for me. Um, I love the colour of these jeans. It's like a mid-wash. Yeah. I'm not averse to a high rise, I quite like that, but a low rise is a never, so nil point on no counts. I oh, like the pocket. Now hold on, let's just see oh. Maureen's little side. Look at the height of Maureen's bum. It's like it's, it's like so sit, sitting. It's it's small but significant, right? Yeah, so I like the pockets. Oh yeah. And they're functional as well. I do actually use these. Oh, cute. And then also, I love like where it hits on my knee and there's no bag. For our slim girls, what you want to do is avoid jeans that kind of overwhelm and make you look like you're swimming in them. And I think it's nice to go for thicker materials. Okay. And it's so funny, when we were growing up, because both of us were really thin, we'd wear leggings and jogging bottoms <laughs> over trousers to make us look like we had more meat on us. Absolutely. It was, and I think skinny girls will know, I don't have that problem anymore anyway, but there's a time where you like, you wanted to look like you had weight on you, you know, especially if you're African, they're looking at you like, what is what wrong with you? What is wrong? Are you eating? What happened? My mum took us to the doctors because she's like, they're so thin. But yeah, um, but thicker material is a good idea. Agreed. Let's try on some jeans. What are those? What are those? What are those? So I decided to put Maureen in this pair of jeans that everyone else has worn. And as you can see, it's twigs swimming in the pond. It isn't great. But you know, I can imagine people who like this look high booty the little booty we had disappeared into thin air it's gone swimming but i feel like these are a nice pair of jeans though to be honest with you i wonder too let's get you another pair of jeans oh so we just took a break a little kfc break fact and we actually decided we like the jeans yeah we take it back we do um the baggy jeans look cute on you we do i've changed my mind i think if they were ever so slightly longer I could be here for them. So I feel like these are a universal nice jean. Hello. Mm, very interesting. These are a pair that went on Lydia. These are a high-waisted skinny, but the waist virtually comes up to Maureen's low-riding bra. It's very high-waisted on her. Like, the, the booty looks nice, the pockets look good. I think you just need a slightly smaller size. Like, look how nice that looks on you. Maybe mid-rise is better for you. Mid-rise, that would work a lot yeah. better. Yeah. The basically. bum looks good, look at the booty. That looks real nice. It looks tidy, it looks tidy, snatched and gathered. Let's get some mid-rises on then. I think mid-rises are perfect. Okay. This is a really nice pair for Maureen. And I get it, you don't need high waist. No, it's not necessary. She doesn't need high waist, shock. Mid waist, looking good, skinny, 
I can see the detailing on the legs. You see it? Yeah, I it? see it, Maureen. Right. Right. This is why this, this kind of style is like my ultimate pair of jeans. Yeah. Um, again, we got the good ankle. We got the detailish, and see these are a fresher pair, which is why you can't see my actual kneecaps like you mm. could in the first ones. And then yeah, because I've got like a short torso. Yes. I feel like short toes. Mine is short as well. Yeah. I've got a short so torso. So we got matching short to torso. Like my torso is finished. It's ended here. <laughs> yes. Okay. Other than your crotch is looking a little long. But crotch is a bit long. De long in the crotch. Oh, yeah, we can do that. Need your eyes. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. There we go. So yeah. So for the more leaner girls who are a bit more, would I wouldn't say straight, like with little curves. Let's call it little booty curves. Um, a mid rise might be quite flattering. And a little crop and the detailing. I love it, Maureen. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Shall we get everyone back in and I'll give you my final thoughts? Okay guys, that is a wrap from us. I hope you enjoyed this video. I, I might add clips of my jeans that I like, but I might put it on my Instagram so you guys can follow me on my Instagram. And what I really wanted to do was show girls of different shapes. These are the girls that I have around me who I know and love and think are fantastic, but there's girls of so many different shapes. So if you ever want me to like do some styling or talk through outfits with you, I'd be open. And what I think is really fantastic is that it's quite interesting. We realise that we've all got almost quite similar numbers. So, you know, 20 between 28 or 26 and 30 when it comes to our waists. And it's like everyone has got a different pair of jeans that looks different on them based on their proportions, not necessarily the numbers. So I will say ignore the numbers, girl. And equally, don't be afraid to try styles that you think won't suit you. Mm -hmm. You'll be surprised. Cause the way how the flares looked on Lydia, I was like, oh, I need a flare. I need a flare. You get a flare. <laughs> you get a flare and you get a flare. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Give this a thumbs up, especially for my girls coming on here. Maury's been on here a few times. But for the girls who, they, they haven't necessarily been on camera before. We clap for, clap for my lovely, amazing team because they're fantastic. So send them some love, send some love in this video. And if you guys want to see anything else which maybe involves other people and gives, you know, real women real advice, let me know. And in the meantime, I will catch you all later. Bye. Bye.